and this qualification, everything to the receiver. Just cable the, the receiver, and you will be able to cover 328 feet. Gotcha. Yeah. So each, let's say for example, you have a big system here. So you you start with transmitter, then on the corner you have, you know, double face receiver. So you can take that one, dry contact relay, only for double face and cable, and this one next, and so on. We'll be able to cover four uh, corners. So mixed cells, what that means mixed cells? If you see here, there's two cells, upper and below. So transmitter receiver. So the same cells send the, uh, the data communication to the other cells from transmitter receiver and get back the, uh, the data just to confirm, yeah, there is communication between. So this is why we call it the mixed cells transmitter receiver at the same time. So would you only have to run a dry contact to both your receivers? So if you had four corners, you'd only have to run wiring to either corner or something? Exactly. And then you'd have a receiver? Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Integrated web base for maintenance <coughs> and setup. So on the MaxRis, on the MaxRis, it has uh, electronic board here at the bottom, and it has an IP here. So the IP, if you put temporarily just to the laptop, you have the web base. You just put the default IP address, username, password. You will be connected into the tower, and you can even create the virtual zones that I explained previously. So from transmitter, the first 50 meters to be zone number one, and so on. Once you did the, that, just an unplug, you don't need any more of the, uh, the, the IP interface for that. Because in that case, if you have a big, big, big site with a couple of them, you just need you know, to grab the RS-45, link it together, and connect to the Maxibus. So the Maxibus will discover, like, let's say, 12 towers, and will be uh, consolidated. Temperature of use, minus 40 plus 70. So uh, we have a couple of installation here, reference. Uh, using master, uh, Maxeris during the winter conditions, so there is no issues. And even because it's uh, it's powered also, there's no solar in, in that case, and there's some energy cable, so the heater will uh, 